Oh, that doc. Oh, what doc, doc? Who doc? Well, the, well, Who's doc around here? I've got a song. I've got a song. You know why? Because Australians everyone's a white. Australians all let us yeah. admit that we are bloodthirsty. Well, this is We've stolen land and taken kids without a treaty. Our land abounds in genocide, a violence once wrought free. Oh. In history's page, let every stage advance. Remembering all my family. Australians. Oh, I'll start again if you don't let me fucking finish. Remembering my family. Advance Australia Dark. Bruce McGuinness. Or well, all these families. He wrote that poem. I don't know, Bruce. I know that he wrote that poem. You see, I did things with him too. Did you? Look, Batman tried robbing a spine for deal for treaty. said that was never for real. Tried bullshit, bullets, ballots, and Bibles taking away our children and saying they ain't tribal. So stand up all your gubbars and tell us, show us your intent. Did the right thing by paying the rent. Now, since the day that you've arrived here, I've had nothing but to have my people live in fear. They disappear. Then they have a colonial inquest, and now you've got coronavirus. virus. So, so what? <laughs> Welcome to mine. Be my guest. I understand that I am the man that's been going through this goddamn life, even though I'm a citizen. 60 years now, and it still hasn't changed. I'm still second class rate because I've got to defend my fucking aim and, and person of who I am on my own land to everyone that's been let in. Man, can you understand that every time there's this insurgence of this uh, population growth of migrants from overseas that don't really know me at all, though, and then they've got a like, attitude to look down upon me because of what they've heard, see, not because of what they've gone to learn. It's absurd wording of what my true identity is being. And every time I begin to start to tell them, I've got a beautiful, majestic formula of life as we know it from way back in my dream time of creation. And I own it, Buzz. You know, what's really understanding is, is misunderstanding is a myth interpretation of my mythology. It's my th mythology. You see, it has a, a myth story that is myth-ing, myth-ing ah. from all the ingredients of knowing anything that is true. Because your myth is a myth. And it's a mist out on what is really inside that is flowing. It's a natural art. I'm the real Shakespearean from the start. I shook a spear back at the very beginning of creation, don't you know? And listen to this, check it out. The truth has been told beyond all doubt because we are the first peeps. It's my stone axe that was found beneath the layered volcanic layer. Don't you know? It was a planning of a succeeding. That's my succession because I said I'd prove it one day. And matter of fact, y'all did it for me. Don't you know, eh? Now, we are the highest incarcerated rate in the entire human race, per capita. Don't you know that, mate? And we're being killed still, incarcerating. My cousin just the other week went in, three days we couldn't find a fucking body. And I'm spewing that you don't listen to anything. And you want us all to be like sympathetic to what you're fucking going through now? Oh, well, check this out. Somehow in our hearts we do. We have, a, we have this moment, but the happiness cycle is on its path of happiness, so let it go. It's a natural flow. That's what water does. To be is to be naturally. It ain't a fucking question. Don't you understand? Tell me someone who chose not to be, and he'll tell him, time waits for no man. You can't fucking be not be, because it doesn't happen unless you're off the face of the earth, see? And if you want to ruin your life and take away the gift that is given by the very great creation that lives in both my eyes and my dreaming, well, believe me, you're missing out on a whole mythology, yeah? You're missing out. And, you know, you've miscomprehended and misunderstood and, and, and miss the whole ingredients of all my good. Because I'm the greatest environment. I'm a descendant of this man. I've got, I've got bad behavior built up all a good idea, so I could say it like it is. I guess I can, because I'm a real man who had respect for everyone. I even know about every man. I took the time to understand. And they've been on my land and still can't even find a little glimpse of just a little bit of the fucking knowledge to respect me and understand. None of them really know me. All they really show me is such tainted disrespect and push their truth upon me and my fellow man and my kin. So let me just stop for a moment and let me put in 
that until you really know me and understand, take some time to ask me the questions of how it was and why it is, and how I'm a Neanderthal and you are all Homo sapien. So my bones will be left. I'm going to leave my skull in the museum because I'm a Nelson and it's going to say, ha ha, told you so. Just like he did on the Simpsons, that little Nelson. He was like, ha ha, I did that since I, ever, since I heard it. Ha ha. You know? And, and if you ask Flipper, he'd be like, Do I, has anybody done it any better? He'd go, uh, 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 uh. That's what he'll say. That's one's for Plugger, my fucking Plugger Thorpe, who wrote songs with me in the day. Mate, we have got understanding here. They asked the fucking Board of Education, could I go up levels because I was too fucking bored. I was running amok and I was going missing. I couldn't handle school. I was way too smart for all the shit that was in there, as well as the fucking behaviour that was manifesting throughout it. It made me feel like, ooh, I couldn't stand it because the indifference of not understanding it, every time I tried to insert the truth of what I am, I would be shut down and told all about myself. But I say, hang on. I don't know what I know. You're, you're just listening to every other person that pretends they do and put me down with this derogative note. You know, why don't you just try to flow a little bit higher, though? It's not that hard. What, if I raise the bar level just one inch, everyone's like, that's not allowed, you can jump that and we can't. Well, white man, you can't jump higher until you learn to fly with the man that's landed on the ground in the spiritual way. In the spiritual life, you will fight, but you have to attain a richness. That's why I'm the fucking fittest, because I'm a man who's an infillionaire. I'm so rich, I don't make dollars. I make a hell of a lot of sense, though. Hell yeah. And when I try and hand out my change, do you think people want to change? No, they don't. They think they know all they need to know in their life as they've grown. But I can tell you, just by looking at them, none of them have. They look at me like, it's, oh, you're sleeping outside. Why don't you come inside? I like being outside. I actually do. I don't think I ever want to go back into a house, as a matter of fact. I like being outside. I want to live outside, like I used to. Everybody wants me to have a house. But if I light a fire to keep warm in winter, is the fucking fire brigade going to come down and shut me down? You better not. Because I like being outside. I like having a fire. I hate the fucking gas things when they're around. They make me feel fucking all horrible. It's a different heat. It's not right. It's not natural. I'm a natural person. I flow naturally, like a river does to the sea. It takes a natural path that is governed to it by gravity flow, downhill slope, and a magnitude of magnesium, right, to guide it through. Because that's what makes the charge through to the rock. It has a connection to it and it's rolling forward. Like gravity does though. River flows aren't controlled by what you see, yeah, how the earth spins, by a, but, but, but it's, it's also controlled by a, that magnesium iron gate connection to each other. It has a bonding agent that brings all the ingredients of purity when it goes through a cycle of a dream, natural flow. I never understood that I, I knew such amazing things because I never heard that in anything. I probably wrote it though, or read it, back in one of the encyclopedia editions that I did as a kid. Yeah, that's right, 29 editions I read by the time I was about nine. Yeah, I got bored with it. I started, started doing the dictionary. I was finished with Macquarie in Oxford by the time I was 10, and they still wouldn't put me up. Oh, his, his attendance has to improve. We don't think that he'd be uh, we don't think that he'd be like well received with that type of attendance in, at a high degree. We'll look at it next year and review, said the board to me. Well, they did and they did again. Got my hopes up thinking oh, I was going to go up years. Never did. Though they called on me at year seven to do, you know, leave me in the maths class for the year 12s when a teacher who did the maths always had emergencies at home, so she was called off. Robert. Uh, the principals, base principals here to see if you'd like to teach the year 12s. I do the year 12s uh, maths today because uh, Mrs. I won't say her name because that's a shame. It's not called code of practice in, in protection of, of uh, you know, privacy. It's a privacy act. People think they know it. 
my own health service is starting to do this thing. Yeah, I was part of the mental health campaign. And now they're analysing everybody who's coming in, and that's like demoralising. Like, cycle you evaluate as soon as you walk in and you move, where are you going to see? Oh, he went to the doctor. He's talking about a hip that's hurting. Oh, but how, was your, how, how does that make you feel? Has it made you feel a bit depressed? And then they're marking you like it's a test, like an evaluation. Oh, he's, he's probably a four. Now, he looked really depressed. He's down out. He didn't smile. Why do we have to smile all the time? And when we try to bring up a smile, everybody's going, oh, can you keep it down? Nobody wants, no, no, it's very, you're very loud. I said, oh, well, I didn't know we were all born in libraries. Yeah, everybody seems to be alive, and they're going, shh, and I go, eat. I go, I think they're doing it. Oh, yeah, yeah, sesame, sesame, you do shh, I do eat. We get closer, we step closer, shit. <laughs> it's fun. So every time someone says, shh, I go, eat. Like doing a Sesame Street wording, join the word. Shit, <laughs> muzzle. <laughs> Uh, muzzle! Uh, Zam! You know, shh, so, Zam! There's lots of ones you can do. Which one do you want to play with? That one you just, just did. Me, yes. and, I'll, and I'll do it back to you, alright? Cut! If you see